and your brain says, I need to get better. You don't have to worry, oh, I missed it, I, I'm no good, I'm that. That's too much time that's wasted. We need to move on the fact that God is love. Now, here's the thing, church. We have heard this sermon before. We have seen the actions that I said before. We are not clueless as to what this means, but church, we forget. We get distracted, and sometimes we fall into a trough of pity, and we find ourselves listening to people who have the airwaves telling us how we should feel. You should be afraid of Washington. You should be afraid. Go vote Tea Party. <laughs> no. What I say is this, that we have the strength to make things move. We have the strength to make it work. We have what it takes to do it. And you must turn that deaf ear to those voices that are calling you to feel bad, to feel scared. You must turn that blind eye toward the ones that say, follow me as we go across the cliff. No, it's time for us. Yes. It's time for us to act with what we know we have. We have love, then we act with love. We know it's powerful, then we act powerful. We are the community of the church. The church is God. Come on with me, church. I'm going to leave you with some few words. And those words have to do with commitment, faith into being, praxis into action, reflection into power. All of those words, church, the dynamic that I'm talking about, running through it all is commitment. Church, when times are tough, when people are saying words that do not sound friendly, it is time for us to understand we are a community you are not alone. We have each other. God wants us here for a mighty work, a purpose. Our work will not be uh, 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 set aside. Come on. It will not be set aside because we must move forward into the light that shines constantly, the light of salvation. That is the light that God has for us. Church, I'm going to end now. And I hope the babies did not disrupt too much because up above my head, I hear music in the air. There must be a God somewhere. Amen.